I let myself be vulnerable with Christian last night, so for him to go on and lie about our intimacy today feels extremely confusing and upsetting, and I feel like I've been manipulated. Looks like Christian might not be as cool dating a transgender woman as he said he was, because during the latest episode of 90 Day Fiancé before the 90 Days, he denies going all the way with Cleo. Do you guys have sex? Um, uh, no. Cleo and Christian first connected online, and she's been open about being transgender. And while Christian has insisted he's okay with it, he previously admitted his family wasn't as accepting. They were supportive, but after my family found out that Cleo was transgender, it's caused somewhat of a rift between me and some of my family members. During Sunday's episode, after Christian traveled to London to meet Cleo, she gets together with her friend Jane and admits things are rough with Christian, but she's hopeful about their future after doing the deed for the first time. Christian and I had sex last night. <laughs> One thing led to another, and it was really nice. I would say that our sex was romantic for sure and passionate. Cleo tells Jane the attraction is definitely there, and he wasn't awkward about her body, which she says was a nice surprise, since she's the first transgender person Christian's been with. But Christian, he tells a different story. And let's just say we hit a couple of bases. Uh, you could say we got a double. Yeah. No, uh, no home run work. I'm kind of working our way up to that. Yeah, all that doesn't sit well with Cleo, who says she is agitated and confused over Christian being so vague with producers, since they agreed to be open and transparent about being intimate. I don't want to be anyone's secret lover. I have no interest in that. I would rather just be alone. There has been, you know, a, you know, a few instances where Christian's insecurities about what other people think about him dating a trans woman have gotten in the way of our relationship. It really hurts because I thought we were past that. Cleo says Christian told her he didn't want to talk about it in order to protect her, but she's not buying it. There definitely has been some gaslighting. Maybe he doesn't want people or his family to be able to know that he has been intimate with a trans woman because he doesn't want to hear their opinions. But Cleo still wants to give the relationship a shot and confronts him with her friend by her side. At this point, my trust in him is, is like nearly zero percent, but my heart, it's still there. After the episode aired, Cleo weighed in on her Insta story, saying she's not ready to talk about her feelings, and rewatching it all back was triggering while she's trying to be strong. So fans will just have to wait to see how it all pans out, but Cleo says Christian's got work to do. He needs to be able to separate what people think about us from his own feelings about our relationship. If he can't do that, there's a slim chance of this relationship working out.